Hi everybody and welcome back to the channel. It's Nick here. Um, I recently bought myself a Runcam 2 4K. I've been wanting uh, one of these cameras for a while after seeing how amazing the parks look from above after first filming um, from my FMS Super Easy about two years ago with my GoPro Hero 5. A few days ago I contacted my local council to do something about the extremely long grass at one of the fields that I fly at and I didn't tell them that it was too long for my RC plane to take off from of course basically just said please mow the grass so we can enjoy the space. Thankfully they acted on it very quickly. As I fly around I want you to appreciate the effort that mine and your local council goes to to provide us with these great outdoor spaces and if I can employ you to do just one thing while you're out using these spaces whether it's flying planes or just going for a picnic please don't abuse them, treat them respectfully and pick up all the litter you've created like coke cans and coffee cups. Leaving that stuff around just spoils the place for everyone including the wildlife and the waterways. As you're enjoying the view, I just wanted to share a story with you. Um, you may well be all over this, but in case you're not, uh, recently a YouTuber pulled a stunt that garnered all sorts of attention. Uh, and while I have my opinion about it, I'm definitely not any kind of aviation authority, so I won't be analysing the footage at all. Um, I'll just be reading a news article that was released in late January 2022, just to compliment the video. The incident that I'm referring to is the Trevor Jacob mid-flight aircraft abandonment. So the title says, pilot and YouTuber Trevor Jacob accused of purposely crashing his plane. The YouTuber, this YouTuber may have blown his career sky high. Trevor Jacob, a 28 year old pilot and YouTube creator is being investigated by the FAA after he crashed a civilian plane in November, the New York Post reports. Jacob, who posted his crash on his YouTube page, has been accused by aviation experts of masterminding the incident. What well, makes it sound like he's like trying to, you know, go for world domination or something. He regularly shares his videos of wild stunts and antics on his page, which has more than 130,000 subscribers. When reached by the post, Jacob declined to comment. Well, <laughs> of course, why would you say anything? It's only going to incriminate him further. His crash clip showed him flying over Los Padres National Forest in California when his small tailorcraft BL-64 aircraft had engine failure. The video featured Jacob bringing the ashes of his friend Johnny Strange so he could spread them during the flight. One shot then showed him parachuting out of the plane and landing on the hills as his plane crashed in the distance. He then filmed himself finding his wreck wrecked plane and claimed he had no water or cell phone service and was in pain from hiking through the bushes. I'm exhausted, I'm so thirsty, I'm scared, I'm in trouble, I'm cut all over the place, Jacob said during his walk. The only option I have is crawling through these bushes like I have been for the last five hours and uh, I'm in pain, man, I'm hurting, whatever I'm going through, I wish upon nobody. Other aviation vloggers have questioned the authenticity of the video and wondered if it was staged. I don't think they wondered if it was staged, I think they were pretty certain it was staged, I think they were just like possibly erring on the side of caution saying that they wanted, I don't think they wanted, I think pretty much everyone knew. Uh, Trent Palmer noted in a video he made examining the stunt that Jacob seemed to have unlatched his plane door before the engine failed. Um, Palmer private pilot stated that Jacob didn't seem to look for a secure place to land. That's what lots of people said. Then he looked at aerial footage of the area where Jacob landed and said Jacob should have tried an emergency landing with a higher possibility of success. The YouTube beast is an interesting one. It obviously rewards people who get the clicks and get the views. So we're always going to be in a battle of getting people's eyes on our videos, Palmer says in his video. This is just way over the line. It frustrates me because when someone, go, when someone does something like this, goes out and apparently intentionally crushing an airplane to get views, it looks bad on all aviation content creators. Dan Milliken, host of Airplane Channel Taking Off, revealed in another video that general aviation pilots don't typically wear the type of parachute that Jacob wore when they fly. Milliken also stated that Jacob was wearing a skydiving parachute. Pilots who fly small aircraft opt not to wear these types of parachutes because they can be too heavy. The FAA confirmed to AV Web that it would be investigating the situation and could not discuss it in full detail. Well there you have it. So if you're not up with it, Trevor Jacob crashed his plane and there's about a zillion videos so if you haven't seen any of those ones and you're only first learning about this from me um go and check it out there's heaps of stuff i mean if you're interested in this kind of thing the guy just seems like a real so-and-so i don't i don't agree with what he did and it wasn't the certainly wasn't the brightest thing to do 
Um, and as other people have um, stated, the amount of revenue that he would have got from the video, it's it's tiny. Like it's just it's just not worth it. I mean, if you're how is how is he relying on this? If he can go out and buy a plane and crash it, I mean, it's just not worth it. I mean, the the the, the financial reward does not. Um, just doesn't make any sense like why would you go and do this kind of thing it would have cost him more to do it and obviously deal like did he not foresee this the legal issues that were going to come from this like he's going to lose his pilot's license all this stuff from doing something so silly I'm, I think um, he's going to regret this for the rest of his life anyway um, thanks for hanging around guys and uh, enjoy the rest of the flight I'll just leave you with the audio of the flight take care and I'll see you in the next video